welcome to a new match day vlog and i thought i was going to show you right now what i bring on match days loads of things that didn't go our way pretty tough to take Hello and welcome to a new video and welcome to a new match day vlog. If you're new here, my name is Isak and today we got a game against Vendelsö, which means it's another derby game and it is one I've been looking forward for this entire week since we didn't end last week's game in the best way. Anyway, I woke up about an hour ago, I've eaten breakfast, had some porridge with a banana on the side. Kickoff is 3 p.m., which means it's a pretty late kickoff compared to the ones we have had earlier. So for the upcoming two hours, I'm probably just going to chill, relax, prepare myself mentally, then eat some lunch, pack my bag and head to the pitch. It's an away day, but it's like 30, 20 minutes to the pitch. And if you want more match day vlogs, hit the like button. And if you don't want to miss future episodes, hit the subscribe button. Right now, I thought I was going to show you our Thursday session where we focused on crossing. So see you in a bit. A few weeks ago someone asked me what I bring in my kit bag and I thought I was going to show you right now what I bring on match days. So it's very simple, a bag where I can pack everything in, resistance band to do some pre-activation before the game, shin guards, tape, underlayers, short and long in case it gets cold, box black and white. Now when I think about it, I don't need the white ones since I'm going to wear the black boots today. Game towel, GoPro batteries, water bottle, two match gloves. I'm going to wear these ones today, but in case something happens, I got a backup pair here. New shoes and old shoes. I'm going to wear these, but in case something feels odd, I can change and switch to these. And then the rest, the match kit, I'm going to get when I'm in the locker room. My boy. Yeah! 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 Yeah!
Pretty tough to take a roller coaster of a game. We were down 4 1, and then the last 15 minutes, we scored two goals and was so close to score another. But, like, I don't really know what to say about the game. A bit upsetting that we conceded four goals. First goal, it took a deflection of one of our players. Second goal, I get a touch on it, but don't manage to get it around the post. Third goal, a great shot in the top corner. What can I say? Fourth goal, it's just sad. However, the energy that we had the last 15 minutes is energy that we need to have throughout the full 90 minutes. Feels like we wasn't really there this game. Loads of things that didn't go our way and uh, we need to work on that. Now we have had three tough weeks and it's time to bounce back. All right, that's about it. A bit shorter episode today. I hope that's all right. Obviously a very tough defeat, but next week we got a game against Värmdö. Hopefully we can bounce back in that game. Anyway, have a great week and I will speak with you in the next one. Bye.